So I got a question from Castella about casting uh, at, accurately at medium trout stream distances. There are a couple things you want to keep in mind when you want to cast accurately. The first thing is the path of the rod tip. The straighter the path of that rod tip is from back cast to forward cast, the more accurately we can make this cast. If I start sweeping around my body in this manner, it's very, very difficult to get an accurate shot. If I'm trying to hit that first hula hoop, this is very, very hard. My fly usually goes well past my target. What works much better is if I keep this rod tip traveling in a much straighter path, straight back and straight forward. By casting this manner, now I can get that fly much more in line with that target and deliver that fly to that target. When I cast, there's another straight path I have to keep in mind. And that's this one. If I make a sidearm cast here, straight back and straight forward at a low angle, if I want to make this cast accurate, I can't sweep around my body and I also can't make this arching move up over my head and down. If I do that, I lose a lot of that accuracy, I lose that tight loop. It's very, very difficult to make it towards that path. So not only do I want to travel in a straight path back and forth here and here, I don't want to curl around my body. I also want to travel in a straight path, straight back and straight forward, straight back and straight forward. I don't want to curl over my head in this manner. This is kind of like a windshield wiper over your head. This is like a windshield wiper around your body. And this move right here. If I do that, that's going to help me, one, get nice and accurate. All right, it's going to get that tight loop, that straighter path. I'm going to be able to deliver that fly to that target much, much easier. Another thing to consider is your thumb placement, where your thumb is on the rod. You want that thumb right up on top. When I hold that fly rod, I don't want to hold the fly rod kind of straight in my hand like this, getting this pad well up on top. That makes it very uncomfortable to start in this position here. Just notice my knuckles are starting to turn a little white. What I want to do is hold that fly rod nice and relaxed in my hand with that thumb on top and then just drape that line over my finger when I start. Then when I begin to make my cast and I want to try and get nice and accurate, I'm going to drive with my thumb. It's a push with my thumb here that's going to direct that fly where to go and be able to send it out to my target. So thumb on top is definitely one of the best grips if you want to get nice and accurate and be able to deliver that fly out to your target. So drive with that thumb, travel in a straight path, nice tight loop behind us, nice tight loop out in front of us, and that's going to get that fly right on target where we can start to deliver it right to those uh, hula hoops or hopefully to those fish.